Happy Valentine's Day, Patriot ladies. I hope you have a wonderful, wonderful day. And uh, it looks like those Democrats already got them a, a Valentine present, though. Um, uh, a Democrat won that a congressional seat uh, that used to be George Santos's. And uh, that gives Republicans, y'all, just a one-seat majority. And I know that ain't good, Patriots. That's real bad. It's real bad for us, uh, especially considering that uh, Republican Ken Buck, he's retiring at the end of the month. And if you do the math or get somebody to help you do that, uh, that's going to leave that's going to leave Republicans with a zero seat majority. And um, then if you uh, look into it a little further, um, that uh, ethics investigation into Matt Gates is moving right along. Um, it seems that his old buddy uh, Joel Greenberg is locked up in prison doing an 11-year sentence right now. He decided he wanted to uh, cooperate with investigators, and had he turned over a bunch of documents and sworn testimony that said he has personally witnessed Matt Gates sleeping with underage girls. Um, so uh, he'll probably be leaving Congress too, won't he, Patriots? Because we can't have somebody in Congress uh, that's been sleeping with underage girls, can we? So um, what that means is uh, we're going to be welcoming uh, Hakeem Jeffries as Speaker of the House pretty soon. And, um, and I know that sucks, Patriots. I know it does because that means that we have to end all of these sham impeachment hearings. Um, we've got to end all of these bogus investigations into Hunter Biden and the Biden crime family. All that comes to a stop. That also means that uh, uh, Donald Trump uh, can't be controlling Congress by proxy, by threatening Congress members' jobs if they don't do uh, what he tells them to. You know, the bidding of Vladimir Putin. Um, so uh, that's going to stop too. And, uh, and to make matters worse, um, while all of our Republicans uh, were doing nothing but just investigations after investigations that they knew they had no evidence on, just wasting taxpayer dollars and not actually doing anything for the American people, Democrats have a couple of hundred pieces of legislation that they have already prepared uh, to be voted on uh, whenever Hakeem Jeffries uh, becomes Speaker. And that means that the Democrats are going to spend the rest of this year getting things done for the American people, sending those bills over to the Senate, and then sending those over to Joe Biden's desk to be signed into law. And uh, I know it's going to be horrible for us, patriots, getting things done for the American people, especially during an election year. But uh, I guess we better get used to it. Um, so things will be getting done for the American people, and Trump's going to be in court uh, for the rest of the year. In fact, starting in March, uh, Stormy Daniels hush money Trump uh, it will be in court. Um, oh, and by the way, those 33... Uh, uh, misdemeanor charges, uh, most likely, more than half of them, going to be flipped to felonies because it turns out that um, he was offering uh, money for people to lie under oath, uh, like uh, uh, his uh, his former um, financial officer there uh, that's going back to prison for lying under oath. So anyway, good luck with that, Patriots. Oh, and like I said, um, happy Valentine's Day to all of the patriotic American ladies out there. Oh, and uh, MAGA women, have the day you deserve. Inmate Trump, 2024.